What's up guys, Dull Matter here, and we're going to be continuing the Dragon Ball Z abridged series. So, we watched episode one, um, you know, Goku obviously shows up at Kame House, Raditz shows up, and then he takes off with Gohan, and yeah, then we're starting from there. Uh, so, yeah, anyway, link to the original video down below, obviously this is from Team Four Star, and yeah, let's jump into it. Live animation, toy animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama, please support the official release. Hey, Piccolo. Mind if I ask you something? What is it? You're not human either, right? Yeah. And your dad spit you out as an egg, right? What about it? Are... Are you a Yoshi? <laughs> yes, Goku. I'm a green f***ing dinosaur. <laughs> can... Can I ride you? <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, you know what the best part about that is? Is like, I think at this point, he was still not even a, a Namekian, was he? That, that, I don't think they'd announced what Namekians were. He was still considered like a, a slug demon or whatever they were back in the day. Like in the original Dragon Ball. <laughs> shut up. I said shut up! <laughs> shut up! <laughs> Damn it, why is he screaming angrily making you cry less? How the hell with this room in the timeout bomb? <laughs> Thanks, sweet, merciful God, that's over. Now I can just sit back and... beat the crap out of whoever's coming. <sighs> Great. Raditz, give me back my son! Whee! So, you're here already. And I see you brought the Namekian as well. Uh, actually, that hasn't been explained yet. Oh. Yeah. Well, <laughs> that's what I was just talking about, yeah. I don't think he's a Namekian yet. It's not like anyone cares about him anyway. Well, screw you too! Piccolo? You use weighted training clothes as well? No, Goku. I just love to get naked when I'm around you. Their power level is rising. So, nudity makes you stronger on this planet. That's actually... Uh, sorry to keep stopping this, but that's actually one thing I, I found really funny about the anime. Or, I've never read the manga other than, like, a couple random chapters when I used to get the Shonen Jump uh, monthly issues. But, like, I always found that funny about how Earthlings are, like, the only ones that are able to control their power levels and not seem more powerful they are, than they are. Other than creatures that can change form. Right? So, like, obviously, like, Frieza can change form so he can, like, kind of hide his power level through that. But, like, as far as people who don't have form changes, it was, like, something specific to Earthlings. Uh, no, we're wearing weighted clothing. Oh, of course, because that would be ridiculous. <laughs> so that hair does compensate for something. Ha <laughs> ha, dangly parts. Shut up! <laughs> okay, what the hell was that? I don't know, but let's try it again, from behind. Shouldn't be announcing our attack strategy. Rush him! Damn it, Goku! <laughs> we at least try to dodge this one! Dodge what? Loki! Ah! Ha! You missed me! My bad. Ah! <laughs> Note to self. Less talky, more fighty. This is still when there's a lot of hey, martial Piccolo. arts involved in you it, too. You may be taking a beating, but at least we managed to dodge that one. High five! <laughs> Uh, handshake. Thumbs up. <laughs> G good job. <laughs> uh, excuse me, has anyone seen my arm? You can't miss it, it's green. <laughs> yeah, anyway, listen. I've got one more attack that should do it. Upside is, I can use it with one arm. And what's the downside? You'll have to distract him while I charge it. That's not too Does bad. For five not... minutes. And considering he beat us to a pulp in under one... It... Does he not grow back his arm in this fight? I don't think so. He could do that, like... Man, Dragon Ball Z is so inconsistent in, like, powers and stuff. Also, like, the fact that he, like, never gets big through all of... All of Z. I don't... Well, I guess they don't really use him too much in GT. But all of Z and Super up until, like, the most recent movie, Piccolo never uses his ability to get big. And then they're just like, oh, yeah, I can do that. Ah, oh, never mind. I'm sure you can handle it. Wow. You really have that much faith in me? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Why not? Well then, I won't disappoint you. Here goes nothing! Uh, ready or not, here I come! Ah! Don't 
I'm charging my attack. I got your tail. Please let me go. Well, since you asked nicely. He actually does that Perhaps in a fight, too. So. thought a whole five-minute startup time for an attack is pretty abysmal in terms of usability in battle. True. Back all out! Ha! Got your tail! Again! Please let go? I'm not falling for that again. Pretty please let me go? Well... Oh, that oh, part doesn't happen. Oh, ribs! <laughs> Definitely ribs! Aha! Uh -huh. Attacking an opponent roughly four times your strength in a one-on-one -on -one battle. A cunning strategy. No, 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 not cunning. What's the opposite of that? Retarded! <laughs> That's it, thank you! Now, disregard <laughs> me, Yomeki and I. Uh, uh, Yoshi. I'm not a goddamn Yoshi! When you said you were. It's called sarcasm! What's that taste like? Damn it, Goku! Stop <laughs> ignoring me! Ah, my ribs! I think you broke my... Mmm, ribs. <gasps> Stop! <laughs> ignoring me Ow. and die! Huh? My space bomb! Ah, my space armor! <laughs> we came from space! Ah. Man, another thing that would go on to be underdeveloped is... I mean, I guess they kind of did it in the newest movie again. With Gohan getting, like, his beast Gohan form. and the, But, yeah, like, he, he's the first one to hit Super Saiyan 2, and then he gets his ultimate Gohan form. But they kept, like, building Gohan up like he was going to be huge. And then just not using him. And then building him up like he's going to be huge and then not using him. I wonder if they're going to do that again. If they're actually going to finally like pass off the series to him. Like they were planning on doing after the Cell Saga initially. G Gohan? Uh, huh? What was that? Daddy! No, no, seriously. What the hell was that? We were getting slaughtered out there and you could uh, do that. Uh, oh, crap. Uh, Uncle Raditz is pissed! <laughs> we here at Team Four Star do not condone child violence. We do, however, find it hilarious. Wait, hold on! Oh, what? Mr. Shattered Ribs is going to stop me? Listen, you don't understand! Nothing you could do could ever compare to what Chi Chi would do to me if she found out he died! Well, sucks to be you. I don't have any choice! <laughs> I have to use my last technique! Now die! Full Nelson! A full Nelson? That won't work on me! I'm Raditz. Okay, let go. Seriously, this is starting to piss me off. Piccolo! Ready. Good. Just make sure you give me a signal before you fire that thing. I'm right behind him. Oh, sure. I'll give you a signal. It'll be the last signal you'll ever get. This vein's just... Well, okay, as long as we're clear on that. My concept... Makakasapa! Oh, to hell with it! Special Beam Cannon! <laughs> Is that what you're gonna yell out when you. Oh, God! <laughs> Damn it! And there was no way I could have gotten out of there! You know, you could have flown. Damn you, hindsight! <laughs> Blit. Go, go! After several hours of preparing, we decided. <laughs> Holy crap. And then the on the snake way he goes. Series. <laughs> what? Too soon. I can't believe he's gone. He, he wasn't the first person to die in Dragon Ball either. I think Grandpa Gohan was, wasn't he? Or did they, did they even show that in the original anime or is it just in flashbacks? I'm trying to remember. I think actually he might be because it's just in flashbacks. He might be the first person to die in Dragon Ball. Yeah, pity that. Wait, what the hell? You can regenerate? Yeah, and you know what else? What? I didn't go on by. <laughs> Quick, somebody stop him! Damn it, Roshi! Shut up, Krillin. Oh. <laughs>
Alright, so I got told to watch to the end, because apparently there's like little end credit scenes in all these, so we'll watch right through. Gohan, do a headbutt! <laughs> Super effective. <laughs> well. Yeah, that was that's good. We had uh, so far I'm really liking this. A little some of the jokes are a little bit dated. Um, but, you know, that's to be expected. This, this episode's 14 years old. I think the last one might have been 15. Uh, so, you know, obviously that's going to happen, especially with how fast internet humor changes. Like the doo 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 That's literally the Raffle Mouse song from uh, that World of Warcraft thing from, like, 20 years ago. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. So a lot of these jokes are going to be dated, but it is what it is. It's good. Anyway, let me know what you think below. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.